Every single one of us at some point in time in our careers has been a new employee. Now put yourself in that space just for a moment. What was the hardest thing about being a brand new employee? Not knowing anything, right? And specifically, who does what around here? Let's fix that right now. In Trainual, if you click on People, you'll see Directory and Org Chart. The directory is exactly what you'd think it would be. It's a directory listing of all the people in your account. So as you add new users, they'll show up here. Now look, there are pictures, and if I click on Han here, you'll see he's got bio information in there. That information doesn't show up magically yet, okay? AI isn't that powerful quite yet. So they will have to add this on their own. But once they've done that, this is such a cool way to get to know all your team members and what they do. Okay, now we can see who everyone is and what they do, but how do they all fit inside the organization? That's what the org chart's for. The org chart has two views, the people view and the roles view. The people view is organized by who someone reports to in the organization. We were able to set that when we added the new user, who they reported to, and that's what sets them automatically in their place on the org chart. You can always edit that org chart over here on the right hand side. The second org chart view is the roles chart. The role chart is a map of how all your roles and responsibilities fit into your overall organization. What's really cool about this is that you do not have to have people assigned to a role for the role to show up here pro tip on this role chart. You can use this for future business planning. You can add the roles even if you don't have people to fill them yet and they can show up on the organization chart so you can see exactly where those place. Pretty fantastic. Both the people and the roles charts are built automatically as you add new people and roles to your account. But remember, you can always go back to the side and edit those charts whenever you need to. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Now, if you really want to master Trainual, check out Trainual University in the link below.